Ravi Prasad, uh, MSc Biotech fresher from Bihar, reached out to me asking how can he get a job in the biotech, pharma and medtech market faster. And the problem which he was facing was not technical skills. He was really good with his theory. He was really good with his technical aspects, understanding of the subject and everything in between. Now, where he was lacking? There were two aspects because of which even though he was getting inside the interview, he was getting rejected. So that I'm going to share with all of you and also a message to all my uh, students out there. See, first thing, landing an interview is very, very crucial. And if your CV is not AI friendly, ATS friendly, if the AI of the ATS cannot analyze your CV, you will not get the job. So make sure that your CV is PDF format, not an image, okay, or not a um, image converted as a PDF. Now, the second thing is um, the mistake Ravi Prasad was doing is he, while he was um, giving the interview, so we conducted some mock interviews. During that interview, he started uh, when um, our scientist or expert tried to interject and object that, oh, no, no, this is wrong. He started arguing, right? So during the interview, if you start arguing without data, okay, you, you're free to argue, but argue with data or you start over claiming or you can't explain your own work. Okay, these are all, all red flags. And that is where he was not getting the job. So even though he was technically good, he didn't know that he should not argue with the scientist. He should not start showing off his uh, knowledge instead. He should have that attitude or ability to learn. Okay, now many freshers lack this and the industry wants this. Now it is not me saying it's the industry which has passed this information to me. So I'm passing on to you. If you are trainable, you are hireable. Okay, so train, trainability is equal to hireability and you you cannot be trained if you're not ready to listen. If the viewer interjects and tries to confuse you and you start arguing, right? So during the interview, stay polite, understand the question, answer, don't answer with presumption, understand, listen carefully, take one minute time and then answer, that's fine. But do not try to argue and improve on your communication skills, specific, specifically English communication skills because most of the companies are in South India and they have English as the main language. So you cannot really survive there if you don't know English. So if you have a learning ability and if you are trainable, you are hireable. And that is where most companies are ready to hire you. All the best.